Hey guys, it's Mahogany Hank here. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, it is going to be a Shein haul. I mean, really, are you even surprised? I mean, don't like every other video be a Shein haul. I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, I'm just saying. All right, so we're going to go ahead and dig in. It is a mini haul, not that many items, so I won't keep you that long, but let's go ahead and jump in. All right, on to the first outfit. Here's the first outfit. It is this blue dress. It's not quite maxi length. It's like, I guess, midi length. I guess midi, I think, is that the right term for it. Um, it does have slit on the sides that come like like mid-thigh. So it does show skin. I'm going to be honest. It shows a little bit of skin. Um, I just paired it with this uh, biker jacket. I feel like this just great for my fall season here in Arizona or like the winter time because it don't get that bad. I mean, we get some days where it's like down, but not that bad. So I can just pair this and I just think it'll be so cute with some comeback boots, maybe even like some socks and kind of um, scrunch them up a little bit because I do have like these tall black socks. I think that would be like really cute. it will give like a little edgy look. But yeah, and I like this blue color. It's very pretty, very subtle. I think it looks great on my skin tone. I just paired it with this um, gold necklace and I have like these gold little earrings in my ear and yes i think this is cute and i put my hair for a reason for this particular this particular haul because i feel like my hair will be cuter it was cuter like this with this type of outfit i don't know so that's why i did it but yeah here is the first outfit what do you guys think this is like i think my first like midi dress that i have that is like this length in my closet um i don't know like i typically go for like either like the shorter ones i don't really get like maxi dresses because i just don't feel like they look cute on me at all but this is like a heavy medium i think it's cute and yeah so let's go ahead and get into the next outfit okay so before i change i did want to show you what it looked like without the actual jacket so you can see how it looks just like a plain dress um very cute i wouldn't even say plain because this color is like anything but plain but still subtle if that makes sense and i feel like it's like a good transitional piece like i said i can wear it now in our fall and um winter months here in arizona or I could wear it in the summer because, like I said, it does have, like, high slits on the side. Um, so it's, you know, airy when you walk and stuff, which is very great for, like, the transition into summer months. I probably won't be wearing this in the summer because it'd be, like, 115, 115. And I'm talking about, like, from 5 a.m. in the morning to 8 a.m. 8 at night. So, nah, not summer, not here, but still cute, transitional, and I like it. So I want to show you guys, and these are the sleeves, and I like these sleeves. They're not too short, um, and I like tight sleeves like this on my um, arms. I don't know, I think it's flattering for my shape, and it's just something that I've always liked. But, yeah on to the next outfit okay so here's the next outfit if you have watched my channel before or been on my instagram before you have seen this exact same shirt so i actually had this shirt before however i am not good with white clothes and i don't know why i'm just not that great with white clothes and keeping them like super super clean like and super nice looking if that makes sense so i had to get rid of that one and i bought me another one I almost got the shirt in black because I'm like, oh, black would be better, but black was more expensive. This one was cheaper, and I was like, it'll do. And I actually got it in a bigger size this time, but I really do like this shirt. It is just like me. I am huge on popcorn. I think the little, like, um, what do you call it? I guess container that the popcorn com comes in. I think it's very cute, very girly, very sparkly. It just adds that little pizzazz to the shirt, if you know what I mean. So I think this is very cute. It's many different ways you can wear this shirt. You can, like, fold up the sleeves. You can wear it with, like, a pencil skirt you can wear with the jeans i have on now some um dark denim it's many ways you can pair this shirt which i think is great um it's one of those pieces that although it doesn't seem like a staple piece because it has like this pizzazz i guess in the front it's not like a basic piece you would keep to me it is in my closet it's a staple for me because i obviously i bought it for two this is my second time buying it okay so i wanted to show you guys this shirt um like i said second time buying it but i had to get another one because i had to let my other one go and i did not realize like how often i was going to wear this shirt when i bought it the first time so very cute i mean just imagine going to the movies with this on like can you even imagine like come on now i mean can you imagine like you just got popcorn you know they sell popcorn at the movies but you already got on your shirt so you think should i get some should i not you know what i'm saying okay 
too much. But anyway, we're gonna go ahead and go to the next outfit. Okay, so I wanted to come back and I wanted to show you this shirt with like a jacket on. You see how this adds the extra touch to it? Something about biker jackets in general. Okay, although this biker jacket is not from Shein, Shein does have some really cool biker jackets that I've seen on, or moto jackets that I've seen on like other YouTubers channels. And I am like so tempted to get like two or three in like different colors and not a black one. But this is like for real, if we talking about staple pieces, this jacket, cause it literally takes an outfit from oh it's cute yeah it works to that's cute it works you know what i'm saying you see how i add that little attitude in it so that is why you should get a biker jacket okay on to the next video because we're not this ain't video about that it may be a video in the future hint hint but let's go ahead and go to the next oh. let's just take a moment of silence for how this shirt just ain't working <laughs> Okay, we're back. So this shirt, I had super high hopes for this shirt to work out. No, I got it too big. That's the mistake. And sometimes, you know, you can get items that are too big and you can still make it work. However, this is not one of those items. Because of the neckline, you see how much space I have left? Like, it should be tight like this. The shirt should fit, like, a little bit better. But because it's too big, it will not work. And it's sad because, like, y'all, this shirt, it has weight to it. Um, although this material, I was like, is it double line? And it's not. But whatever material this is, it's just, I don't know, it has, like, weight to it. So it just makes me think, like... This shirt would have been super cute if I would have got it in a medium. I got it in a large. That's the thing with Shein. With, not even with Shein. With any place that you shop online, here's a tip. Always look at the reviews. And a lot of times people even post pictures of themselves in the outfit. So you can kind of get an idea um, looking at somebody else's body shape and like them having an outfit on and seeing like how it works for them and if it will work for you. Um, I feel like I did this for this shirt, but it still was like a little a miss, which is okay. It happens. It happens. Um, you know. It's sad because I'm like, okay, when I try this on, I'm like, who can I give this to? Because clearly, I can't wear this. Like, this one going to go to, like, Goodwill or something because I can't wear it. I mean, I could send it back, but, I mean, I'll just, like, give it to Goodwill because I have a whole lot of clothes that I need to declutter that I need to give away and just let somebody else have them. But, yeah, I'm sad because this is going to be the one that just set them off, sis. It was going to set the whole, like, <sighs> world off. But it didn't do that for me. It didn't, okay? Alright, on to the next outfit and the last outfit. <laughs> Alright, and so here is the last outfit. Let me tell you why I like this outfit. You're probably looking at it and be like, that's so basic, that's so plain, nothing special. Not special. <laughs> nothing special but exactly that is why i like this outfit because you can change it up you can layer it in any way you can add on the trench coat you can add a moto jacket you can add stacks of jewelry you can do so much with just basic pieces um so it is this shirt that i got from Shein. it is just a basic black shirt love the neckline i probably should have got it in a medium i got it in a large and i probably shouldn't have done that but it's okay because i can still work with it because this is not a piece like the other one where you can't like fix it like the other shirt it's no going back from there like that just has to go to the thrift store like i have to get that to the thrift store okay this one different that is why i love basics and i'm telling you this now hint hint i do have a video coming up soon that's all about basics because i feel like if all you have is basics in your closet and you have literally like maybe like one to five like really like big bold like jackets or statement pieces or like jewelry that's literally all you need like i feel like you can make it just off of that you can literally make the outfit just look amazing okay by just adding something a little extra or you can just do like the 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 look like this just a classic look and be basic out here but you're not basic okay because none of us is basic <laughs> okay so yes this is the last outfit like i said i got this shirt this skirt is actually not a part of the haul however i'm sad because i got some of my hair grease or hair oil on it so it's like a little thing i'm trying to hide that and not show y'all but now i said it so now y'all gonna look right here in my mid section okay but anyway Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Stay tuned because I do have some more videos coming up. I'm so excited for the future of Mahogany Hanger for this channel. Stay tuned. And like I say in every single video, if it is any hauls or any ideas you guys have for videos, place them down below. I'm so serious because I want to do things that you guys like, not just stuff that I think will be good ideas, you know? So let me know what ideas you have for like clothing, like a thrift haul, under the Walmart haul, under the Shein haul. Um, um, you know pajama haul whatever it is put it down below and i may do it just for you and i may just go ahead and put your comment right in the video because you suggested it mm -hmm. yes i may all right bye guys